Hey everyone, uh, today I'll be talking about why um, Malaysian Chinese, why some Malaysian Chinese do not know how to speak Mandarin. Technically, to start, the reason as to why some Malaysian Chinese that, uh, how do you say, they don't, they did not receive like um, education in that matter. Because like, when we're in kindergarten, I mean, most of the kindergarten, they'll teach you the basics of Mandarin, like the super simple yi, er, san, that kind of thing. Then after that, when you go to primary school, there are two types of primary school in Malaysia. So there's one which is SK, Sekolah Kebangsaan, and the other one is SJKC, Sekolah Jenis Kebangsaan China. If I got that right. So then, for those who go to SK, like me, um, we don't really, how do you say? I did not attend like Mandarin classes until Standard 3. Uh, they started to implement that uh, those who are Chinese have, have to take Mandarin classes and those who are Indian has, have to take Tamil classes. And we were learning the materials which are from Standard 3. But the problem is we do not have the foundation. So it was, it does, it, to me it did not make sense because I can't even read and write like the basics and then you're throwing me into intermediate level so I struggled a lot in that class <coughs> To simplify it is that some Malaysian Chinese um, did not receive the Mandarin or Chinese education hence we cannot speak our so-called mother tongue lah. but because the only how do you say the only subjects that we had to study like everyone in Sekolah Kebangsaan SK has to study is English and Bahasa Melayu or Bahasa Malaysia so that that's the only two language that all Malaysians would know regarding Mandarin and Tamil um, I'm not too sure on that matter but Mandarin for the Chinese lah I'll speak on Ch on the behalf of on behalf of Chinese because I am a Chinese um, most of us don't know how to not most okay okay some of us some of us know how to speak we know how to listen but um, when you want us to write and read that is a problem like like um, what I was saying was uh, I can speak Mandarin but my Mandarin is terrible and yes because I learned to speak Mandarin from listening to Mandarin songs and speaking with friends who are who has Mandarin speaking background if I did not have this encounter I wouldn't be able to speak Mandarin as well this is why Malay some Malaysian Chinese can't speak Mandarin it's because we did not uh, receive formal education on that matter like it wasn't a level one level two level three thing as in my case i would highlight in my case because in my case we skipped level one and two we went to level three so i could, i did not understand anything yeah it was terrible i still remember the teacher forcing us to read when i can't even read then i have to go to one of uh one of my friend who is quite um she has quite a good knowledge on mandarin so then she will have to help us write pinyin pinyin is like uh, the pronunciation of the word but it's in like a b c d so it's easier for us to read instead of the chinese character so yes i had to read with the pinyin yeah i cannot recognize Chinese characters because I wasn't taught so yes so you've got your answer okay uh, so that's all for today uh, I hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching